Richard Sherman's a was Richard Sherman fifth round? Fifth round. He ain't a Hall of Famer. He will be. No. What? Don't cuss in the first minute on YouTube. Bing, bing, Otherwise, bing. they'll they'll demonetize you. Not that we're monetized. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Two Beers, Two Mics. It's Miller. It's Nate. Episode 16. Ooh. Let's get it. Let's oh do my it. Gosh. Intro. New Belgium. Shout out Ryan for leaving these in the fridge. <sighs> oh, yeah. Thanks, Shout producer. out producer. Producer. Leaving us these nice beers. Okay, let's get right into this bad boy. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What? You just go fucking hard in the paint right away. <sighs> hey, how she I haven't it. seen you in two days. What are you even doing? That's how she likes it. Um, you hanging out? Your yeah, sweater man. is hilarious. This is going on YouTube, by the way, because that is so funny. Well, it it was where ugly sweater day. At People school, need at to school. see this. No, they don't need to see it. Oh no, well, you already went to school with this, so who cares? That's just in the surprise community. There's like forty thousand people in that school. In in the surprise community, only that's, that's, that's it. I did um, go shopping and stuff, so the right, people just see it. All right. It's all good. It's all good. You can show. You can show. It's it. pizzas and cats and Christmas trees. It's an ugly sweater day, and I just went ahead. It's and ugly. Did it. Yeah, well, that's what I did. You nailed it. I did it. <laughs> My name's on the plaque. Oh, you won. Oh yeah. You won Best Ugly Sweater? Last year. Oh. Uh, not for this one? No. Did you win? Okay. Tell, describe last year's. Do you have it, pictures it was, of it? It was a red one with just cats in the Santa hat. I'd be like, Ryan, pull that up. It wouldn't be a video. I was like, Ryan, pull that up. I want to see it. You would, you know, but no. So, you know, like Facebook or anything? Is, that, is it on Facebook? No. Is it on your school website? No. I think if you won something, you'd want to be on the website. It's on the plaque. My name is it, Sketch in the Trophy. Are you in the trophy room? Oh, yeah. Or trophy. You have a wall or a room? I don't know what it is, but it's on a, it's on a plate. That's hilarious. Yeah. Like you have it, or your no, school no, has school it? has it because every year it changes. I came in, I came in second year before. I came in first last year. I'm getting some static back backpack here or backpack uh, backpack f- uh, feedback. feedback. Oh, it's gone. It's gone. No more. Okay. Uh, so James Miller, we had a good time on Sunday. Yeah, man, it was a good time. Great time. Two different won't, types won't, of chili. Won't, won't be able to do it again until another ten days, though. <clears throat> what What are you saying? Nothing. I'm just just <laughs> stating out facts. They won't be able to, won't be able to have another excellent Sunday until ten days from now, which I will know. be like New Year's Eve. You guys will be missing me. I will be missing you. That's fine. I miss you're you guys too. You're my bro, man. You're my bro too, bro. Yeah, man. I love you, man. I love you too. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hearts. Yeah. Send out the heart emojis. Hey, oh, uh, are you ready now? No, hold on. Oh my gosh, your your wife's uh, shredded chicken, chi- uh, white chili, white chicken chili, white chicken chili. The bomb, 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 bomb. Dude, but I like the flavor of yours, though. I like the little kick to it as Megan's. well, man. Megan knows what's up. I like that. It was awesome, but you didn't leave me any. I tried to. Oh, your wife packed it up. Mm. That's not on me. Your That's wife a- gave me a whole ziplock of all things. Because <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> well, we, we never get our damn Tupperwares back. I gave you yours back. You brought one thing to me. I gave it back to you. I know, but I'm saying in general. Oh, we're not those people, though. Don't I label know. us like that. I'm not labeling you. It's just out you of habit. You treat me like I steal your shit. It's out of habit. You know what? I'm not a lighter stealer, okay? You know you were smoking back in the day? And you're like, yeah. who's stealing lighters? Who's yeah. stealing pens? Yep. That ain't me, though. Yep. I'm not that guy. My pens are always gone off my desk. Same here, man. My superintendents I come in. I hate my being gone. come in and they just. Oh I hate being God. gone from school. Like, if I have to go to a function away from my classroom and I'm not at school, so I hate it because I have to take all my pens with me that I want. No, you, yeah, I have to hide mine. Yeah. In a drawer. Yeah. But you know what happens? They get out. They're not. <laughs> they find it. They find it somehow. They go searching. Or maybe I leave them in my truck. I don't know. No. <laughs> it is what it is, baby. Uh, so, NFL. Huh? Want to no, I want to I want, I go to NBA first. You want to talk about Steph Curry? I Steph Curry go. looks like he's talking to us on the TV right now. I looks know. like he's on a podcast. Hey, bud. How are you? No. Um, I have a question, though. sitting on the bench hurt, loser. No. So, speaking of someone being hurt, thank you for the segue. Segue? Luca? Yeah, segue. How does someone sprain their ankle and out for a week for a month by having a foot in the air? You talking about Anthony Davis? Yeah, I sure am. Like, how do you how do you injure your foot going up for a layup and you sprain it in the air and now you're out for a month? That is a good question. 
And I think the only person that could do that would be Anthony Davis. Yes, it is. Yeah. <laughs> or McCaffrey. Hey, he's still rocking and rolling. He's, he is. I know we're taking shots at I these know, guys. No, again no, no, he's time, all good, though. But, but he, one he's, consistency. Hey. He's, he's balling out, Things though. are certain in life. Death, taxes, and Anthony Davis being hurt. <laughs> 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 it's so messed up. Sorry, Anthony Davis. Sorry, AD. We love you. We do love you, but damn, man, I don't understand how also, you sprain- maybe shave that. I don't understand how you sprain your ankle in the air. Was it wobbly? Was it like flick? Did he flick it? Just- it? Did, it did like uh, <laughs> it's? A, he's always got hurt ankles, dude. Like the gravity, like took his ankle and just somebody grabbed it. No, like a ghost, gra- like a ghost grabbed it oh, and twisted just, it and said, hey, dude, it's time. It's, it's, like it's, father been, time grabbed you, his foot. You've been playing. You've you, you been playing too long. You, you got to sit down. <laughs> That this is a good streak, but we gotta we gotta we gotta, gotta end you. it right now. Hey, we gotta put you down a little bit. Oh my Bring gosh! Back to hey, we didn't want MVP AD. We want we want hurt AD. Right. He was playing like an MVP. He was legit. Uh, he was legit. A contender. I mean, I don't know if you give it to him, but he was up there. Right. What a ten game span or something like that. He was. Wow, okay. He was. He was balling out. Yeah. I oh, know for sure. Stuff, but um, I got I got, I got a little bit of breaking news for you. Oh shit. Yeah. New developments on the Sunday ticket. Purchases from the NFL. I love this. Keep going. Intr- I am intrigued. You know who now who, who emerged as a front runner and it might get done by tomorrow? Elon Musk. YouTube. Oh shit! Really? YouTube. Wall Street Journal put it out there today. Um. Hmm. But my, but our guy Arvi Ari. Yeah. yeah. He, he 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 put it out there too. And he's he's usually good. He's no. He's the one who tells us the draft picks. Right. He's picks. good. <laughs> I don't know how he so, gets that info. Because, because I saw the Wall Street Journal, I'm like, okay. But then when he started putting out his own stuff, I'm like, oh, oh okay. 100%. 100%, 100%, right? Yeah. So he said YouTube is the front runner and it may, a deal may get done. Google has the money. Google has the money. And it may be done by tomorrow. Does that mean we have to go get YouTube TV? No, they won't have it done right now. I mean, they'll have it done, yeah, but you but won't it, kick it, in until next year. It'll announce, yeah. So do we need to have go get YouTube, YouTube TV? I will go back to that because I liked YouTube TV. I really did. Yeah. They didn't have... They claim they had a lot of sports, and they do have a lot of sports, but not specific to what I like to have as sports. Uh-huh. They have a lot of college sports. They have a lot of obscure we, sports. You, you're still going to need to buy the packages, the MLB extra innings, the NBA and league you can pass. Always get good deals off that too. Yeah, you, I mean, you're going to need to buy those things because those are going to be separate. Or I premium. actually use my Fire Stick. Oh well, that too. <laughs> the yeah. jailbroke Fire Stick. If you if it's still working. I mean, uh, not my jailbroke. One. No, I mean, no, 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 no. Actual Amazon Fire. Stick. My legit one. That 4K. I have watched TV. all the station programming on there, and don't put anything else on there. That's not what I do because I'm a good person. Yeah. So I just wanted to t- give you that breaking news thing about that. That's actually that. pretty cool. Yeah. I say that's cool. Well, I I can't, dude. YouTube might pay I'm us just, one day, so I'm, I'm cool ho- with that. I'm just hoping it's going to be on a platform where you where. You can get whatever team you want and watch them. That's what I want. I want to be able to go, okay, I want the Red Zone channel because that's always awesome. Right. And then I also want, we're going to get network TV games. That's fine. And then I want to pick my team. Right. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. I'll pay a price for it. I don't have to watch. Like how baseball baseball does it. You can pick your own team for $20 or you can have the whole league for $30. Yeah. Yeah. I'm like, that's awesome. Why would you do that? Why would not do that? Oh, man. Right. Speaking of baseball. What about it? We have not talked about it at all. What? A lot of people are gone and signing for this is money being thrown around. Well, do you hear that uh, the, the Carlos Correa deal might not go through? What? I didn't hear that. Yeah, because uh, they... This is the problem. You don't tag me in anything. Well, I just saw it right now in the bottom line. <laughs> 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 they um, That's breaking news. <laughs> they they, they po- The Giants postponed the press conference mm-hmm. due to he didn't pass his physical. Oop. No, that's a real problem, actually. Yeah, you have to pass your physical. Uh, yeah, that's a thir- that's happened before in the NFL. Guys are like, "Oh, I'm gonna sign with this team." They can't pass the physical. They go, and then the that's a thirteen year, thirteen year, three three eighty deal. Oof, that might not happen because he didn't pass his physical. That's that's a, that's a, that's a lot of money. You that is probably, a lot of money. What? Okay, so what entails in the physical that you can't pass? You're already in the major league baseball. I wonder if it's they don't like how is. Knees or ankles or shoulders are, are acting up. Do you think up. it's team specific? It has to be. Like everybody has, has their own physical. It has to be. So, like when we say, "Oh, it's fi- it's we have to pass physical," it, but it's all team specific. It's team and doctor specific. Doctor, specific. yes. Like like our doctors don't like this. Are our you, doctors say there's a red flag. Because you know this knowledge, or are you just saying? No, yes? I'm saying it's, it's it is what it is. Like, oh, okay. Like our team doctors said this is a red flag. Well, this team doctor may say, you know what, he, he can get by. You can that's probably true, get a year. Doctors' or opinions vary. Exactly. Mm-hmm. So that's why people always get second and third opinions because when an athlete gets second third opinion they get it outside of what the organization says that's true no you're right 
because the, the organization will, will give you a list of five, six doctors. Didn't Zeke Elliott do that too recently right. when he got hurt two yeah. years ago? What was it? Yeah, something like he, that. Yeah. He went and got a second and third opinion. Right. Like team doctors will give you five, six doctors list, but they're all on their on their list, which is under their 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 contract, yeah, the right? They do. It's a business. So you so then you go. I'm gonna give my own opinion for someone I trust, oh, and yeah. then that's what 100%. it is. Do right. you get that feedback in your ears? Oh my I, god! Right now, I just got it right that now. Zzz, yeah. like a, a bee stung the mic. <laughs> so, but yeah, no, it it's automatic. It doesn't mean anything. I'll cut it out. So I, I think I think uh, that's going to be in- interesting if that goes through or not. But yeah, baseball signed a lot of money. Baseball signing. Yankees spent five hundred million on two players. Yeah, you need some. Well, well, one player was three three something. But I'm, gl- I'm glad you retained him. Yeah, he we had to. Di- he would look different, and it just it just bothers me for what he said. Just, just bothers me a little he bit. He didn't like that the GM put some shit out no, there. No, not that. He That's said what I heard. he said he turned down more money from San Diego and the Giants because he wanted to build his legacy. And I'm calling bullshit. Okay. Because if it Let wasn't it out, dude. because if it wasn't about the money, you would you would have took the 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 two ninety or three hundred million dollar deal that was on the table already. Yeah. Not saying the, the, the two thirteen from March. I'm talking about you would take the new deal of three twenty or three hundred million dollars if it wasn't Oof. about if it wasn't about the money. If, if, it was about your, if it was about your legacy, but no, you wanted to hold out, so then you took three sixty. You know what I mean? So it's he not, bet on himself though for no, the year. No, no, I'm not saying he, he didn't deserve it. But what I'm saying is, don't come out and say it's about it's not about the money when you could have took less, and you didn't. That's some people rich people say. Well, I'll, <laughs> but if it's truly about your legacy and you want to leave money on t- on the table for other players, I no, I totally see. Three hundred million dollars for nine years. What's wrong with that? If it ain't about the money, then play for free, bro. No, well, not, you, ain't, you, ain't, you ain't doing that. You, you ain't doing that. You ain't doing Why that. couldn't you? Just play for free. Because don't you don't, eat that shit. Because it's too, life is too expensive. I'm just kidding. Dude. I know they get in the kind of lifestyle and they gotta have a certain amount of money. And blah, exactly. Blah blah, blah 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 blah. So good for you, Aaron Judge. You know, good I know I'm happy you. for him. You know. Well, you don't have to burn your jersey. <laughs> That's true. You I know. To burn a jersey. Dude, I was about to light Dude. that shit up on fire on on the on the on barbecue grill out back. You wouldn't do it. Yeah, I would. It, it wasn't signed, so I don't give a shit. Oh, what? That's a waste of. What are they? hundred bucks? Don't do that. I didn't buy it. I would have sold it. But I didn't buy it. Sold it for eighty bucks. I didn't buy it. Uh, you know what I would do? What? I would fake autograph it and sell it on eBay, and be like, "Hey, I got to a game. He, I met him, and just like find a fan photo online with him and be, pretend that's you." Yeah. Hey, I'm just putting it out there. All right, you are. You are. <laughs> Hey, you keep looking down like you want to. Are we on a time limit or what's up? No, I'm just looking at the, what's the next topic I'm, I'm going to talk about. That's all. Oh, uh, next topics? Yeah. Well, well, we're going to the NFL next. Oh, are, we, are we done with the NBA? We didn't really talk about it. Yeah, Luka, I mean, well, we Luka did talk about the NBA. We Luka talk, got hurt too. He got ejected. Maybe that's what I saw. Yeah, him and him and Kid got, got ejected. That's what I don't like is, is Luca acts like he didn't do anything. Right. I don't like that. I love, okay, I love Luca's game. His game is sick. Take well, away the flopping, though. Well, shit, Jaja got ejected for talk, talking to a fan. I, yeah, what was that? That the, didn't, the, that the didn't referee, make no sense. The referee overstook, over, overstepped his bounds. Yes. This doesn't make no sense. And he thought it was it was trash talk or whatever, and it wasn't. And, oh, yeah, and his dad was FaceTiming Jaw from the locker room, right? Tell, him, tell, tell the fan, don't worry about it. it, it it's not on you. It was, it's on the on the idiot ref. And Dude. Seriously, hey. what are we doing? Okay. It's an yeah, interaction exactly. between. What are we doing? That's what you want, entertainment. You want kind, fun interaction with the with, with players in the how many guys, dude? How many times Shaq jump into the stands and then grab somebody's popcorn? Exactly. exactly. Or how many times have you seen Devin Booker do it? Or oh my like, gosh! You know, there's so many players that have done that. Or they just sit with somebody, take a sip of beer, and run back out. There. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's Kevin awful. Garnett did that. That's you know what, what I mean? That's what's awesome about it, though. Like, oh my god! You know, you know what I'm saying? That's what. Oh, dude, shit! I just realized we're watching the Knicks. Uh, I don't know what I was. Li- they have the black logo on the court right now. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry to interrupt, but I was like, I, hey, that looks slick. I like you that. Like that? You don't like it? You like the black jerseys? Yeah, the black jersey is nice, but the court I don't like. Oh, Golden State's down by seven. Well, New York me, was hot for a minute there. They still are. They had seven. They won seven straight. Is it seven straight? Yeah. Oh, I thought they won five straight, and that was, and then the last one, and then they won they the won. One. They won four straight, lost. They won seven straight. Oh shit! Yeah, okay. I'm behind. I'm not paying attention. To NBA I don't pay yet. attention to NBA until Christmas time. Right, like well. next Sunday, I'll start watching it. <laughs> we talked about that. Yeah, that's right. Right. Hey, they're even promoting League Pass. Like, come and get this shit. But I really start watching it after All Star break. Speaking of basketball. Now what? You know I've been hurt, right? You didn't play. Listen. Oh, listen, you just fucking listen to your, idiot. You just idiot. listen to your friend. You idiot. So, shout out Hutch, because the only reason I played today, you remember Hutch. You remember yeah. Hutch, right? Yeah. Shout out Hutch. Um, he said he's coming to town. I t- I've been taking two weeks off. I've been good. I'm doing everything right. I'm mm. doing the heat. I'm doing the ice. I'm doing the massage ball. I'm doing the, everything I can, right? Stretching. Lots of stretching. Well, how come when I said you ice, you, 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 you yelled at me? I didn't yell at you. You kind of did. Oh, it's texting. You capitalized it. What did I say? 
Megan said not to. Well, I didn't say it like that. Yeah, you did. That's how I read Did I hurt your feelings? A little bit. I forget you're in the medical field ish. Uh-huh. Like you're kind of in the medical field. Well, I was field. in the medical field and now I'm still teaching it. But that's what I'm saying. It's like yeah. I forget that about you. I know. So sometimes I'm like, shut the fuck up, bro science. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I'm so sorry. That's how I feel. I go, it's what is, good. and then I forget that I'm like, he knows his shit. What am I doing? It's okay. Hey. Yes, sir. Just tell me next time. Just show me your, just show me your <laughs> masters and just go, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh-huh. so we played on Monday. Like and yesterday? Yesterday, right? I did not play great. I did. I played kind of timid because I was worried about what my What shoes foot. did you wear? I, brand new Zion 2s. Shout can't, out Nike. You can't oh, my wear, God. You can't wear b- brand new shoes when you come up from an injury. Listen, bro. I'm going to tell you something right now. Hey, what is Zion nice? Oh, mm. my God. W- w- what color did you get? I got the, the white ones. They're all white with the black top with the black tongue. And then they have the neon uh, blue, yellow, and pink on the back with the bright green I love Jordan that. logo yeah, on the back. Yeah, 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 so I like yeah. all white shoe with a black tongue. I like that look. So okay. I played yesterday. Uh I only got to play. Are those new? I, yeah, I've had them for a little. I bought them, and then I got hurt, so I couldn't use them. Oh, I know you had those. Dude, I go through basketball shoes. So I try to find, like, shoes that are, like, these were on sale. Are they better than Kyrie's? Because you like the Kyrie's. Two different shoes, but right now, ooh, I don't know, the peach. Those those Kyrie's fly traps that I have, the fives, ooh, awesome. But, are they better than the Jordan 36s? Yes, because the Jordan 36s no, don't stay tied that well. The 35? Is it, which, which we like better, 35 or 36? 35 I like better than 36. Okay, so is, is, are they better than Jordan 35? No. Okay. But they are lighter. The Zion is more. Yeah. Zion's lighter? Oh, wow. Surprisingly. Okay, so you know the Air, Air Zoom Generation 1, right? Yes. The, the LeBron ones. Yeah. That shoe looks like a chunky piece of shit. Yeah, honestly. but it's light as shit, though. Oh, my it's God. Like the I own the, the SVS, what, SVSA, whatever, St. Vincent, St. Vincent. Yeah, 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 yeah. The yeah. Green, green and white ones. I one. have the green and white ones. So I put those on. I thought I was going to flip those shoes. They're so comfortable. Dude, I was in heaven. I wore them out. I told her I, and I couldn't buy another pair yet. I mean, if they weren't so damn expensive, I'd buy another pair, but I can't. I'll wait till they retro. <laughs> well, they come out with the 20 version, the all-white ones, but I don't, want, I don't want the all-white ones, though. I, I do like the, the green one. They're, they're nice. They're very nice. Um, way better. So kind of Zion has that. Well, my point is the Zion has that, too, where it looks like a big, thick shoe, like a big heel. Well, he needs one, though. Has a, well, that's, it's designed for him. Yeah. That's why Cameron, my son Cameron wears them, too. Yeah. He loves them. Cameron got big club feet, Flintstone feet, so it's perfect for him. Huh. I had the little bit of room, like, you know, I, worked, I got a 12. I didn't get 11 and a half. I got 12. <laughs> my, my, my boy. <laughs> <laughs> but putting them on, I was a little nervous stepping around, but I was doing all my warm-up stuff because I'm 40 and I got to do all the warm-up stuff. You do I now. can't just come off nope. the floor you, you and gotta go. You got to stretch and you got to oh do a little warm-up. Oh, my God, stretch and mobility and all sorts of shit. Yep. Icy hot in random places. Yep. Dude, it's so played a couple of games yesterday. It was fine. Today, though. Are you feeling it? No. I woke up in the morning. Okay. I put, I put heat. Well, last night I did heat, and then this morning I did heat on my my foot again, right? More stretching and heat. It seems to be the trick. Bone spurs are a motherfucker, dude. It's oh. right in the middle of plantar fascia. They so, are. Anyway, fast forward. We were supposed to have 10, 12 guys apparently today. Uh, six. Yeah, I was saying no one which, showed up. Which it's hard to go back to back sometimes. Yeah. I get it. It's cold. People's beds are warm. Fucking losers. No. <laughs> get your ass up. No. And so we decided to play king of the court, full court. So it's just you trade off and on. So you go down like someone starts and you get – here's the funny thing. You're supposed to get – they said two dribbles in the beginning from half court to finish. You get, you, know, you can get a shot off, you can get a layup, whatever you got, right? You only get two dribbles from half court, right? And then the next person goes. So if you miss, that person goes down and grabs the ball, then goes and plays that guy. So it's a half court game, but it's basically full court mm-hmm. you know, in somewhat. I played four games. I won the first three, dude, mm. against some ballers. Mike, shout out Mike, shout out J-Mo, shout out Hutch. These are big boys, tough. Jay, Jay's a, Niner, Jay's a Niners fan, so he's got bragging rights right now. He's really letting me know about it. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, I was a little hurt for a little bit there. Like, I was kind of like, man, my foot doesn't, doesn't feel 100%, right? That was a long story. But I kicked all their asses, won three in a row, lost the last one. And they didn't tell me that you could play. I kept watching them dribble four times, five times, and I'm going, you guys said two dribbles. Because I was getting, I could hesitate, get to, get to the hole on the big guys. Dude, I, <laughs> I won all those games off two dribbles only. Wow. <laughs> yeah, but they were mad. And then I text them, I'm 40. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm 40. It's still, it's, all I got to say is, like, I was pumped. I know it's, I'm bragging, but I was pumped that I was kind of, I was playing pretty well in one-on-one situations. Well, good, man. 
You feel okay? I feel great, actually. Okay. It's well, a, there's a slight pain, but it's tolerable pain. Does that make sense? Yeah. Tomorrow morning will be a different story. I l- listen to this. This is my idea. I know okay. we're putting this on the pod, but I'm going to play tomorrow morning with Hutch because it's the last day I get to see him, right? Because he's in town and I'm leaving town. But I'm taking. I'm not doing anything in Washington. No, right. no, I no, no. So more, more rest, basically. Yeah, just, just put your foot in the snow. Anyway, I'll cut all that out. <laughs> just put your foot in the snow, dude. It's not snowing. Well, it's supposed to snow today there. Yeah, that's what I saw. Or tomorrow. Uh, no, yeah, I think tomorrow. But then it's oh, gonna tonight. Be, yeah, and then but by the time we land on Friday, it's it's, it's gonna gone. Be, yeah. Oh. So you want to recap uh, week week fifteen? All right. Enough about me. You want to recap week fifteen? Any, any surprises? <laughs> Let's talk about the one giant surprise, the new NFL record, the yeah. uh, largest comeback. Yeah. What are we doing, well, Colts? Colts, what are we doing? Hey, Matt Ryan, you need field goal. Just get one. No, get they, one more. They got one. No, just get one more, like oh. in the fourth. Get a field goal. Yeah. Yeah, I don't get it. I don't know how you blow a 33-point lead. Say what you told. Just tell the audience what you said about that when we were talking about it on Sunday. I, I want people to know what you what you said. That That is worse than what the Ravens? No. Happened? No. Oh. <laughs> What? I, I'm try- <laughs> no, I'm trying to. I'm trying to remember. I said a lot of you shit said, on Sunday. Yeah, I know. We all lots of beer. Yeah, I know. Lots of beer. Lots of shit. I'm trying to. What I was saying. What? How you felt about watching a game and how the Colts didn't have control of the game at all, even if they were up. Oh yeah, I just had. To, I just you had that funny feeling like they did not. They didn't close it out. They didn't finish. They didn't put their stamp on that second half and 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 end the game. You always felt like Minnesota had that second gear to come back and win the game. They have the firepower, so. You got to mitigate the firepower. You have to. You know what I mean. You have to. You had everything but, going but right. I, in you the know, first but half. I was going back and look at the stats. The Colts' offense only scored one touchdown. No, I know that. I know that. So, Special teams so, and defense. So, realistically, the Colts' offense wasn't going to put the clamps down. Wasn't going to shut them out. Wasn't going to finish the game because because they only scored one touchdown. The other came off a blocked punt, kickoff return, pick six. Fumble. I mean, it, it, in five field goals. Mm-hmm. So it wasn't like the Colts' offense was dominating the Minnesota Vikings. They 100%. were not. No, I agree. You know. No. So realistically, when you look, when you go back and look at it, they didn't do anything. They haven't done a whole lot, and they lost their best player in the first quarter. Yeah, for the whole season now. Mm. Dude, injury bugs. Injury bugs. Oh. Especially, it sucks when it's late in the season. Yeah. So we, you're, you lost Duvernay, right? Yep, Duvernay's out for the season. So they actually confirmed it? Yeah, they put him on IR. They must have because they signed Sammy and they said they're still testing. And then that yeah. was what? I texted you two hours yeah. ago? Yeah, they put him on the IR. So he, I so can his, see how that, that his, happens. His regular season is over. That unit was delivered. Huh? What did you say? So that unit was delivered. Yeah. Oh, it wasn't <laughs> so, really? <laughs> oh, <laughs> wow. <laughs> it's okay. We're gonna, we'll are gonna we'll switch it up. My other shock of this weekend was, I don't know if it was a shock. Like they're, 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 they're being a good team. They're, they're playing like a good team. But. Dallas losing to Jacksonville. Why don't you just say Jacksonville beating the Cowboys? That's what I no, would because say. I think Dallas lost the game. It's when it comes down to that game, it's situational football, and Dallas isn't good in situations. No, well they <laughs> were, they were up twenty seven to ten going into fourth quarter. I think they lost the game. No, that's what I'm saying. And that's why I said that. That's why I didn't say Jacksonville beat them. I think that they they lost. And then that that pick six is a. So fluke. you're saying the defense allowed it? The, well, the defense is hurt a little bit too. They, now, don't get me wrong. They but, that, their but, stars. That pick, but that pick six at the very end is a very very fluky bounce off the guy's forearm, and the guy just caught it on fingertips. I mean, that's that doesn't happen. He, I guarantee that happens like ten times in a row. He ain't catching it. He, these are professional athletes, though. Yeah, he ain't catching ten times in a row, which means it's we a fluke. Ask him. <laughs> Just kidding. So to me, it's, it's, it was a fluke the way to end the game, but they still lost, which it which sucks. which kind of like de- demoralizing. Demoralizes. This. Well, the defense is demoral- getting but demoralized. But it but it doesn't make this this week's matchup with the Eagles anything to go home yeah. about. Right home about. Yeah. And now that and now that Hurts might be out for Saturday, who cares if the Cowboys win? Dude, not just Saturday. I heard the whole season now. Oh like, really? What are they talking about? I, well, that's what I'm saying. I heard, I have heard different things. I saw the one article, and mm-hmm. then I was like, "All right, well, that's new." And then you, and then you said it. You go, "Ah, he probably just got a stinger, and he's he'll be fine throughout the week." But I didn't see the play. I saw the play, and he got landed on his shoulder. Yeah. I, th- I think it was a little bit of separation there. Yikes! But um, yeah. If he's out for the reg- regular season, they can potentially lose the last so three games. Ryan and I were playing with the uh, uh, playoff tracker last night at Camus practice because we wanted to see how. Niners would get the number one seed. <laughs> they have to lose out, and Niners have to win out. Niners have to win out. Uh, Philadelphia can lose. Uh, they have to three, lose three. Th- uh, the next two, three games. Uh, yeah, 
because they have cause Niners have four, so they have to lose out, which they could. If they and then hurt. Minnesota has to lose one. And then middle, of, yes. And fuck you. What am I? I should just called you. Why well, do I even have the playoff tracker? Because I, I already did it. <laughs> <laughs> you got all these scenarios. Yeah, in I already did it. Have you fin- figured out how the Ravens get the number one seed? They don't. They can't now. It's so, oh five losses. Yeah, they can't. Oh damn it. Yeah, but I figure out what they can do to two get seed? the pl- playoffs. Huh? Two seed. They'll uh, stay in the playoffs. No, they can't get two seed. Cause, cause when is Lamar coming back, dude? What are we doing? He's supposed to come back Saturday, but now I think they're gonna push it back till next week. I think they're gonna go with. So Hunt. who's your opponent this week? Atlanta Falcons. That's the only reason. Only, that's the only reason why. And I think I think they're gonna just run the run the ball. Oh, do like uh, what Belichick did. Too. Yeah. What was that game that was Patriots last year? They and ran Bills against Bills. And Bills, they, ch- they uh, Mac Jones threw two times in in Buffalo. <laughs> Fucking nuts, right? But but I mean I think Fucking Huntley was Huntley will throw like twelve passes. But I think they're gonna run the ball like they're supposed to. Uh, yeah, the Ravens definitely need to run the ball. If I mean they can, they can potentially clinch a playoff spot with the victory and losses by either New England, Miami, and the Jets. Those three have to happen, or no? Just combination, any- combination of those two. Oh, so two out of three. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So Fun. like like Thursday, I, we will know more on Thursday. I'm excited for Thursday night, I, dude. I'm actually excited because because you know do you know if Jacksonville wins Thursday and Tennessee loses Sunday, Ooh. Jacksonville is number one in, the, in that division. Just like that. Just like that. Oh, I mean, Houston, I mean Tennessee. Watch, Tennessee, Tennessee this playing, is why I love the NFL. Tennessee, Anything Tennessee can Tennessee's playing Houston though, so the likelihood of that. No, but Houston is playing better. Houston is playing better, and I don't think Tannehill is playing. Wait, he hurt his ankle, but he was then he was fine, right? But he he, he couldn't move. Which, still, I know you said it a hundred times. I said it. Why aren't I, we attacking him? But not not only that, though. I'm not trying to hurt him, but just, I'm gonna, hey, I'm gonna mention, finish the job. I'm going to put it out there on this pod. NFL player safety, when it comes to the head yeah. and neck injuries, yeah. the player must lead the game pretty much now, right? Yeah, you get hit in the head, you got to check you. So when a player gets carted That's off. That's a lot, Mike. When a player gets, when a player gets car, carted off due to an injury, why is why is that player allowed to come back? Clearly, Tannehill was not the same person. He couldn't move. He couldn't walk. He was limping, and he had obviously had his ankle taped up. So why isn't that not a player safety and sit his ass down? No, that's that's a good call. I mean, I don't have an answer for you, but I would say why is that different? Well, that's what I'm saying. Why is that different? So you take him to the locker room. We don't know what happens in there. Right. And then he gets to come back. He's taped up and he comes back. And you can tell by his performance and by his walking and his limited walking that he's not the same player. That's true. But he did play and he didn't have a concussion. So, I mean, if he said but he played through it. But, what, okay, so what if we take him back in the locker room? Okay, Tua, the hit, the Tua he doesn't have a concussion, comes back. Well, they did do that. I know that. But that's why the, the rules changed. Okay, so if Tannehill, if Tannehill plays on Saturday and his ankle snaps in half, what are they going to say? Question, though. You don't have to raise your hand. <laughs> <laughs> I do it to my boss all the time He'll be saying something In the middle of something I'll just go And he'll go Fuck Really Right in the middle of this So my question to you is When you're concussed Or potentially concussed Your head's not right But if you just got your ankle Rolled up on Like let me walk it off A little bit Let me figure it out Or if you got your shoulder Landed on Or your elbow Or your wrist Like let me throw us A couple of balls If see I how have my ankle Just rolled up I'm not you getting think, I'm not getting Carded to the locker room <clears throat> But Well hold on My, my point is so you're saying a cart? If you get carted off, you you can't come back. Yeah, essentially. Essentially, in a, in a way. Essentially, right? you don't bring the cart out just for a, a sprained ankle. Okay, but we also can't we can't just discount it just because it's on a cart. You know what I'm saying? We I, should we should I, say I, something like, "What?" It, it's to, uh, to me. Here's my argument. It's different because you don't you're not thinking straight with your head. You know when you get hit in the head. Period. We know that. But if I hurt my wrist during the game and I fell on it or someone fell on me, and it's my right hand and it's my throwing hand. Wouldn't it be up to me if I could throw it? Like, I'm the one that's going to test it on the sidelines. I'm like, okay, I think I'm good. But if I get hit again, then, like, hey, maybe it's over. You know what I mean? But concussion is like, you can't think straight. You have to follow protocol. That's a much different injury. Yeah, but if you can see the player not the same or not right on the field. But he's effective enough to throw the ball. And But at the same time, you say, hey, look, I see the player safety thing. That's where, the only thing I was talking about. There, there's got to be some point where the player goes, I can play, where it's like a concussion is like, Dude, did you just see what happened? Right. Like, they have to explain that to you. You know what I mean? But if you just got rolled up on, well, speaking of rolled up on, yep. nice Kobe's, though. Who is that? Six. Grimes. Oh, Grimes. Quentin Grimes. Oof. High ankle sprain, out for six weeks. <laughs> just diagnosed, just like that. <laughs> oh, oh, he's ne- walking. Oh, my gosh. Never mind. If you just wanted to get free throws, oh, dude. Oh, my gosh. Well, oh they my they God. already called a foul. 
What are we doing? Oh, he oh he landed on a guy's foot. Watch. Yeah. That's hey. Ooh, that did look look good. Oh, that hurts my foot looking at that. He la- but Tan Hills was worse than that. Hey, his foot landed. Look at oh, they didn't show it. His foot, the way it twisted. I know that T- happened to me when I landed on a. Someone left a foam roller on the corner when I was saving a ball out of bounds, <gasps> and my shit rolled ho- so mm. hard. Hey, I screamed so loud. Mm-hmm. The, the f bomb, I f bomb, so why, loud. Why would you not look at it again? It hurt. I can't do it. <laughs> Don't make me look at it. Just stop showing it. It's hey, over. TNT. It's over. Knock it off. It's over. Oh, I was gonna. I thought you were faking me out. Well, <laughs> I wouldn't lie to you, my son. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, hey, the other guy, he was moving forward in his jump shot, and he went straight up and down. And, you know, the NBA is trying to get fouls all the time. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Keep, okay, week 15 recap. Let's hit it. So Colts we, ta- we talked about t- Colts, <laughs> blew it. Jaguars, whatever. Ja- hey, the Jaguars or the Cowboys, that was a good game to watch. No, it was. It was, cool, it was, it was entertaining. It's, I love that. It was entertaining. And I want to see Trevor Lawrence do good. Tom Brady. What are we doing, Tom? Hang it up, Tom. Okay, but hold on. No, Let me put up. this up there. Let me put this out there. We say that week to week with this man, and then we watch him do shit like we watched him two, night, two uh, Thursday nights ago and come back and you're going. Against a four-win team? No, I don't give a shit about They're that. They're both four-win teams. It don't matter. No, still football. No, still the NFL. Don't do that. Bucks have six wins. Don't do that. Hey. Bucks have six wins. Well, at the time. Well, at the time they had five, I think. I'm just, I'm just, hey. No, no. Listen to I my, don't, no. Don't, listen, don't dispute listen, me. Listen, listen, listen to me. Your hatred for Tom Brady just to me. seeps through the microphone. I love Tom Brady, the human being, as me, a man. I got to clip that 30 minute, 31 minutes in. Okay, go ahead. I don't, <laughs> I don't mind him at all. I hate the... Uh, that's, people say I don't mind him. That maybe they, they don't like him. I hate the, 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 what's the, word? the acknowledgement of him being the greatest player of all time. Name somebody that has gets. better stats, go. Well, if you play 22 years, of course you're going to have better stats. Okay, then I can make the same argument for LeBron and Michael Jordan, so don't come at me next time we talk about it. No, I'm going to say Kareem is the best player in basketball. I'll give you that. You just, you just don't want to – you're starting to avoid my argument. Exactly. <laughs> don't wink at me like that. <laughs> so, I mean – I'm out. I'm done with this but, pod. So, for me, before I even think of Tom Brady, I'm thinking of, like, four other quarterbacks. I, I can think of uh, Trent I, Dilfer, I can Joe even, Flacco. No, I can think kidding. of I can think of different players before I think of t- uh, Tom Brady, who's more dominant and more more uh, put the stamp on the game. Lawrence Taylor, mm. yeah, Deion Sanders, yeah, for, oh yeah, for sure. No, I don't disagree. with Joe you. Montana, Jerry Wright, like like <clears throat> those guys. Could you say he's the greatest quarterback of all time? No, I can't even go there. I'm going Joe Montana or Peyton Manning. He's the winningest quarterback. He's the winningest player in NFL history. I would not take that away from him. Well, then what constitutes being a GOAT? That's what I'm, that's what I'm saying. Football, I think, is very, very different. Because in football, it's not just you don't have that one player who's dominant throughout the whole thing. Like the best running back is Sweetness, Walter Payton, or Barry Sanders. Barry like, Sanders, you, yeah. You can't – you can argue those two. What about Emma Smith? He's, he's number three. Okay. You know, but – What about Jim Brown? I didn't see him play, so I, he's not. Yeah, but we know what he did. I know he did, so I'm going to say he's number three or number four. I mean, he's top five. Mm-hmm. But, I, I mean, I can't say that, that Tom what about Brady. Willis McGahee? No. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I can't dude. say that Tom. <laughs> <laughs> you're so. You're so, you're so I, just, I just can't I just say. I just want to think of a random player, so you'd be like, shut the fuck up. I just can't see Tom Brady being being the, the GOAT just because he won seven, seven Super Bowls. That doesn't make, make you the GOAT. No. I mean, he's the winningest quarterback of all time. Dude, but he wins seven Super Bowls. No one else has done that. Come on. That's the that's the no one has ever won six, no one has won six MVPs in the NBA basketball league, but they don't give Kareem, Kareem Abdul Jabbar a award. Mike has five. Yeah, yeah. They don't give Kareem an award. No, we talked about that. I know, but that we don't know the story there. Well, it doesn't matter. Let me email him. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but what I'm saying is, at no point in time in Tom Brady's NFL career did we Love ever look at him as the best quarterback on that field in that league. It was always, when he first came in the league, it, w- it was Peyton Manning, then it was Aaron Rodgers, and now it's Patrick Mahomes. He was never looked at as being the best quarterback in the game. What are you talking about? They always said that. We watch no. That. No, stop it. We, no. They always say, like, it was the biggest thing when it was Peyton Manning no. versus Tom Brady. It it's, was a oh, big fucking deal. C- because of Peyton Manning, not because of Tom Brady. Oh, no, stop because it. Because of Bill Belichick in New England, not because of, of Tom Brady. Nah, I feel like you're just making things up. No, I'm being serious. I feel like you're making things up. You try, I watched a lot of NFL too. You, 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 you were trying to tell me. I, I'm di- I just did. Well, you're wrong. <laughs> That's not true. You are. No. During Tom Brady's career, he was not looked at as the best quarterback in the league. They still hype him up like Tom Brady versus X. Tom Brady versus X. Because I mean, it's the name. That. When you have seven Super Bowls, of course they're going to – it's the name. They were doing that when he had four. They were doing it when he had three. 
I mean, he, when you win, you're gonna get no, you're gonna get looked at. Sounds like you're making my point for me, dude. No, I'm not, dude. <laughs> I'm just talking about as far as pure talent. They never looked at him as being one of the best until he was the best. Which he kicks everyone's ass. When dude, was he the best? Slices and dices, man. You Come you, on. We cheat away the victory. I can't. I See, can't that's give the you problem, credit. though. That's you have that behind the behind this. this you facts. have that. It's facts and it's evidence. I cannot dispute that. I what, can't. What did, I can't give what you credit. What did Tom do? He threw his cell phone away. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Case <laughs> that's cl- that's case closed. No. <laughs> case closed. Next topic. Tom, you should have just given up a fake cell phone. He should, exactly. He didn't do it. I'm, All right. I wouldn't give myself one. Any other surprises from last week? Well, hold on. Um, now that the Seahawks are probably going to be done for the rest of the season. No, no, no. Stop it. <sighs> no, because watch. Uh, <sighs> The Giants won on Sunday. That was a, I was surprised. And I was also, you know, maybe call PI refs. Oh my gosh, horrible! The NFL, Ref. please do better. Horrible. Hey, and I speak for the entire fan base that watches the NFL around the world. NFL, you have to do better. Oh, Don't interrupt me. I'm not going to. I'm, just, I'm letting you know. I'm, I got something for you. I just, I mean, you saw Annie Edgar today with the oh, refs thing. Love it. Oh my, she's God. so awesome. She's awesome. She's a cutie too. Yeah, she is kind of cute. Yeah, how, you know how, how old she is? I'm just, I'm just curious. I don't know. Okay. Wait, you're not going to watch her videos if she's too young? No, 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 no. no. <laughs> well, I mean, I, just now that she's like 16, I'm like, oh, no, I'm shit, sure no. she's like mid-20s. 30? Mid-20s. Do you think, think she's 30? I think she's, I'm going to have to look it up now. I think I'm, she's. I'm saying 27. 27? Yeah. Dude, more and more women are getting in the NFL. I, I, I know. Too. And she does a great job. Shout out Annie Agar. She does. She you want to an follow awesome Annie job. on anything, just shout out, just look up Annie Agar. I, I don't even know, what does she do for a living? Obviously, you can call her. Do you call them influencers when they have these things, or like actors? What do you call them when you just do skits? Like, like Brendan Clifton just does his skits. He did Argentina. I haven't seen it yet, but did you see that? No, I, know, I didn't watch it did yet. France. I didn't watch did it yet. France. Sorry. Okay, Dude, she's twenty. She's twenty six. Boom! I said twenty seven. Yeah, good job. Good job. Um, we you finish with your point about the NFL referees. Could I have something to say about that? Dude, too? it doesn't. It's. I don't care what team I'm watching or rooting for, the. I'm sorry, but if you have every goddamn camera angle in the world, ah, and then you tell me, you tell me, oh, we didn't have the right angles, we don't have everything, That's... I think they're backtracking on a call that was missed, no. which it's not missed. You blatantly needed the Raiders to catch the, or yeah, Raiders catch that football. That guy's foot is, cl- hey, how many fan photos have we seen in videos where that guy's out of bounds? Hey. Fan I, I am so glad you said that. Mm, so I was doing some research and I was looking at some things. PI calls and, and quarterback hits and listen, all that listen, shit. Listen, listen. Not every game in the NFL has the same one, the same number of cameras or oh. camera angles and the same quality of cameras. They need to fix that. Only only the primetime games mm-hmm. will have the sky camera, which you see everything. Sure. Okay, and or the, and the marquee matchups, but not every state, not every like CBS, Fox, NBC, or ABC, they don't all have the same camera angles and camera views. So you, what you see on TV, they don't have that on the field. Oh, I got a great idea. Do it in every in game. Exactly, but hey, but, you make twenty five billion dollars a year. I guarantee. Put a camera in the sky. I guarantee you know that's why we always say well we see it right here on our TV because we have a different view angle than what they do on the field. They may only have four cameras on the field, it's and we and we have six. Shit. It's just sort shit. It has to do. It, it is. It's gambling and shit. It is because there's no there's no way that Raiders is touchdown. There's huge PI calls to uh, oh, non PI oh calls gosh. over the weekend. Oh my gosh, there's a game. I mean, even I know Niners were going to kick our ass, but there's a time where. Um, not Bosa, but some, Bosa. Well, I'll even say the Bosa one. There was one time where Bosa landed on Gino, and they called it. And mm-hmm. I was, I even said, I have Niners fans in the house, and I said, oh, I don't agree with that. That's no. that's an easy. He just hit him clearly, yeah. and went and even held up and tried to get off him fast. Right. I I will say this: George Kittle got away with a middle uh, with a hold in the middle there when my the receiver's trying to get through, and it was like a third and short or something, and it was quick. But I was like, you just called it two plays ago on another guy, right? So why not now? I mean, just. Right. It's just the consistency is what I'm talking about. I'm, I know it's I'm pointing horrible. out that game, but there's but, but, but the Washington consi- game, it's the, it's the Washington Giants. It's the consistency with each referee crew is not the same. Because in one game, I'm, I'm doing this, I'm doing the same thing, and this crew will call it. In this game, I do the exact same thing, thinking it's going to get called and doesn't get called. But it has to do with players, too, and who's out there. and all blah, 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 Exactly. Blah. But also, hey, uh, why are the biggest missed calls or non-calls or bad calls happening in the most crucial moments of the game? Explain yourself. I don't know. I can't. That's that's, that's, dude, that's that's what's kind of heartbreaking about the league. 
You yeah. know what I'm saying? No, like I, it's, I agree. It's like you want to, you know, everyone's like, oh, I'm a purist and all this kind of stuff. And I want to see this and that. And we want to have the best. They always claim like we want to have the best things and competition in the league and stuff. There's. Yeah. You, Mr. Miller in the front. Um, <laughs> I have my hand up. Uh, so speaking of referees and rules and regulations in the NFL, yeah. you watched the Buffalo and Miami game, right? Yep. Remember in the fourth quarter where it was snowing and the Buffalo needed a field goal for the very end. Mm-hmm. And you saw the players wipe off the snow. And the, yeah, the, yeah. 15 yard penalty, you can't do that. I thought it was you couldn't use a towel. You can't you can't use anything to wipe off the off the field. And they had six players doing it. Doing it. And right it, in front of the refs. Right in front of the refs. Like There's two call. refs standing there. That's a 15 yard penalty, and maybe he misses and he slips because it's the snow. It's supposed to stay there. I looked that up too. Well, okay, so hold on, let me ask you this. Does that have to do anything with the like when there's a timeout or there's a uh, Does it players players cannot Let me let me ask you this though. Let me finish yeah. this. Sorry. <laughs> the uh so in Green Bay, I know they have some kind of radiant heating on their stuff. Yeah, but yeah, snow yeah, still yeah. falls. Right. But during the game, like timeouts and, and in between plays and stuff, they have teams of people run through and make the lines. They that, just find the lines. That's, that's all they do. That's part of the NFL like 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 baseball crew. Like sure, the baseball sure, sure, sure. on the field crew. You know, like they, they cover a baseball, baseball field, field with, with when, range. When it's rain, like, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's part of the NFL crew. They can do that. But players cannot do that. I didn't know that. Yeah. So they should have been a fifteen yard penalty. NFL do better. And what are we doing? And that would have put them out of field goal range, or it made it that much harder. Mm. Mm-hmm. Just, just, so that's that's making me steamy. Man. This whole season has been a lot of eye opening mistakes and need, things that need to get fixed in, from the well, NFL. Well, the other thing is that they took away the non, you know, and I don't, I know Carroll and Belichick are on the competition committee, but they took away from. Well, remember last year they had you could you could challenge a, a pass interference. They took that away two years ago. Or two years ago, Sorry, yeah, COVID year, right? Yeah, dude. They, Why not? But they're they're talking about bringing that back as well to. as the roughing the passer, unnecessary roughness. In the NFL, I don't care about the speed of the game. The game's fast nope. enough. It is. If you got to take two minutes out of your time and make sure it is what it is, right? Then let it happen. Also, right. put someone in a booth somewhere else watching all these camera angles. Make it better. You have the money. You have. Don't the, act like you don't have the money. Correct. You have, techno- like you, have, you, all the you have the technology for every every damn game and every field to have the same camera views and camera angles. Artificial intelligence is out there. We have so much. Every technology. stadium should have that sky. That's, 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 should uh, have, you should sky have everything cam. that the primetime games have, yeah. and probably possibly more. Yeah, you should probably put uh, you know some kind of chip sensor deal in in the crossing like, like the lines. I thought all There's all so the pylons have change. cameras. Don't all the pylons have cameras in the end zone? Well, I say that on the primetime games. I don't remember if they do have them on. But all they the, need to. Why can't they have all four all four corners of the, of the you, square? Yeah, how do you not just have one right in the line there? Yeah. You, you need know, to have all, all the borders. Exactly. You know what I mean? Of everything. So if you're going to say, I touch the line of the ball, the tip, you know, went over the line. Like, you don't like the touchdown thing. Like, you just push the ball oh, and come gosh. back. You got, but then you get shoved backwards four yards. Right. But because you put the tip of the ball over, it, it, it's a touchdown. touchdown. That's, I agree with you mostly on that. Yeah. You know what I mean? I agree. Like, I don't know if you should have the whole body in. But or, you should or, land or, in or, there. No, because remember, remember, you can jump on the on the on the corner to the corner yeah. and land out of bounds. Don't even go in the end zone. But that's, so that's another thing too. When you think about um, Earl Thomas had this uh, like fumble recovery deal years ago where he punched the ball out, someone crossing the end zone and they didn't touch the end zone with the ball. They punched it out and the ball hit the uh, pylon. That's a touchback. And then it was a touchback. Do you think that should be a touchback though? Because well, the pylon speaks end zone, so yes, I, I mean, I, I get that. I, I'm great. It was, it was awesome defense played me wrong, and other players have done it too. I just yeah. don't know what I could think I of. Mean, but I, I get that. But I'm I sitting there going, that's. Kind I just of think I just call. think I just think two feet needs to be or two feet and the body needs to be in the end zone for it to land be touchdown. In it. Land, just land in, land in it. it. You can land on top of the pile and be in there, but right. like your body, don't like jump it over and bring Correct. it back. That Correct. Doesn't, that shouldn't that, count. That's not shouldn't count. You know what I mean? Or just, or just even a reach over it shouldn't count. You got to be in the freaking end zone. Yeah, I mean, maybe that's the only part I disagree. Is like maybe not just have two feet, but like you should be landing. Half, in it. half your body should be in it, I guess, uh, at least. Get your elbow in there or something, right? No, like half your fucking body. I know. I, I know we're gonna disagree on that part, but I'm I'm with you like ninety yeah. percent. Well, that's good. I, I, I like I think that's an A. <laughs> that's an A. That's right. <laughs> that's an A. It's an A minus, but it's an A. I'll take <laughs> I'll take that, baby. <laughs> Anything else from from week fifteen? I don't know. I um. I really enjoyed watching football with you guys. Saturday was good. We didn't have a nice relaxing day. Football was great. Um, your game wasn't exactly ex- thrilling. But no, it was We kind of knew what we were getting into. And Deshaun Watson doesn't look that great still. I mean, he might get there. And they only scored 13 points, so it's, yeah. not, like, it's not like they actually And your blew defense played really well. You just couldn't get on going on offense. No. You know what I mean? One they, player. That's all right. And well, actually, one man. Your and lesser one offense is already losing guys. It's right. like, oh. One man cannot continue to call the right plays. And then one guy can't see the fucking field. No, I, I 100% agree. That's why he's a backup. Yeah, no, I get it. 
Mm. Yeah. But I think you guys will pull this next one out, though. I hope so. Atlanta's tough, though. They'll surprise yeah, you. They are. They are They'll tough. They'll surprise you. That's what I'm saying. I say I hope so. Well, let's get into it. In week 16, baby. Let's go to week 16. Let's I was trying to it. think if I had anything. Hey, we're not doing. Are we doing Christmas stuff tomorrow or today? Tomorrow. Okay, cool. What time are we meeting? I don't know, but I don't. I don't. I'll talk to you about it after the, after the pod. All right. Okay. Yeah. Don't worry. I'll cut this out. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Are you gonna? Okay. We're gonna do our picks, and then I'll do the playoff machine, or or after our picks. Ooh, let's do that. Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Dude, we're we're forty five in. <laughs> Good job. Okay. First, <clears throat> first um, tomorrow Thursday, Jacksonville. I'm excited for this game. Jets. Jets favored by one. Zach Wilson is starting. I love it. I absolutely love it. Um. <sighs> Jacksonville and the Jets, dude. This is going to be a good game. And who would have said that in the beginning of the season? I, uh, no, you would not have said no, Jacksonville. No, not okay. You're right. I would have been like, I'll still watch it because yeah, that's, yeah, that's, that's you. Like you that. I wouldn't I'll have watched watch all it. the games. I would be like, but I now watch. that I know what what, the, I know. what these teams are about right now, but but this is AFC though, so you shouldn't be more hyped than I am. Well, we don't always have to separate. Yeah, I I love the NFL as a whole. I know. I got my team. I know. Like in the beginning of the season, fucking Jacksonville and Jets. I ain't watching that bullshit. But I'll tell you, I watch that over a college football championship game. Just telling you. I'm oh just my telling gosh. You. That's what. That's we, my opinion. That's, that's what we we. You don't have to like it. I don't. <laughs> I'm not asking you to come over and hang out with me. I'm just saying this is well, what why I'm not? Doing. I want to. You would watch. You want come over and watch a game? When? I'll be gone on Thursday. I know. Just I'll dumb be in Washington. I try to get you to stay. You. Gonna miss you. Gonna I miss know. you. I know. <laughs> You want to go with us? Say goodbye. <laughs> just meet us up there, dude. Yeah. You ain't uh, doing nothing. I got, I got nothing to do. <laughs> just, hey, the 26th, come up there, and then we'll leave. We'll come back here on the 30th at the same time. Next Monday, I'll, I'll look at flights. Oh, dude, that'd be sick if you came up. No, I ain't We'd have a up. good time. I ain't going coming up. <laughs> <laughs> Get my ass chewed. Oh, you can bring your fam, too. Yeah, well, see. Well, we'll see. <laughs> okay, so Jacksonville, Jets, Jets favored by one, over under 38. I'm saying Jacksonville. Yeah, I'm saying But so. it's going to be a good game. I'm saying it's going over. 38. Okay. And I'm saying Jacksonville. Yeah, I like that. That's a good call. Right? Okay. Wait, who, what are you expecting out of Trevor Lawrence? Keep it rolling. Yeah. 250 yards, two touchdowns. Maybe, uh, maybe I'm gonna go, a pick. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go They're going to get a pick off of him. I'm going to go 278. He tries too much. I'm going to go 278. Would you agree with that? Yeah. He try, He's he tries to fit things. You know, doesn't always. He had the, he had the young arm. So he yeah, does. so he's going to be I can do this. Exactly. You know, I get that. Exactly. He'll, he'll, he'll learn. He'll learn. I'm excited for Trevor Lawrence. I think hey. Zach Wilson's going to mess up again. I think he's going to cost him the game. Dude, I know they <laughs> – dude, some of those throws he was making on Sunday, I was like, right. what are we doing? Yeah. Hey, man. Did, hey, that lob. What? I, lob. I, you lobbed it. You I, didn't throw it. You I, lobbed it. I know. Oh, dude, I know. If I'm Robert Solo, I'm like – I'm looking at the booth, <laughs> looking at my OC going <laughs> – I'm, I'm mimicking saying bad words. No, all you, all you do is flip the switch and just talk to him on the thing. That I know. Yeah. But I mean, like, you want to see face to face. It's one yeah. thing doing, you know, on well, the phone. Well, how do you know he's not on the sideline? I don't know. I assume that he's in the yeah, booth. I don't know. If I'm an OC, I'd be in the booth, wouldn't you? I want to see you up here. Because then I can make, hey, if I see something. And well, I want defense or offense. I want to be up there. I, you did? Or you, yeah, because when you're here, you. I mean, you play football, so you see only see here. Yeah, I'm not saying you can't see it, but, but it's just a different angle when you see I all see 22. Better. I, I can see the formation. I can see and spread. And then you can go, call yeah. timeout right now. Call timeout. You know what I mean? Yeah. We're going to get 10 yards. Watch this. You know, if they come yeah. back in the same formation yeah. or something. Yeah. Like, I, I would like that control. Okay. That's because I'm a control enthusiast. Then we have Saturday games. You are control enthusiast. Aren't you too? Yeah, I am. Yeah. But don't, <laughs> you had to put it out there like that, though. I just want to be. You don't want to say like control freak. That sounds. That sounds kind you, of. You, kind of sound, you just make someone just saying, he's an asshole. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> We're going to do what he says we're doing. It's not like and that's that. That's final. It's not always like that, guys. That's final. I am married. She tells me what to do. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Wait, are you agreeing with what I said? I'm, my I'm wife tells with, me what I'm to do, with, or no, your no. wife tells you what yeah, to yeah, do? Yeah, yeah, same, same. Oh. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm, like, I'm agreeing with all. I was all, like, hey, man. No, 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 no. I'm agreeing with all married men. Oh, dude, yeah, you're right. Well, it goes back to the same thing as what we talk about with kids. Like, we yeah. know that you, we what know. you're doing. We know what you're doing. I don't have the energy for it. No, I don't care. Not today. <laughs> Falcons at the Ravens. Ravens are surprisingly favored by seven and a half. The has Who to- are the Falcons missing? They don't have a quarterback. They have the well, rookie quarterback. Oh, that's right. Desmond Ritter. Mm-hmm. That's right. Sorry, yeah, yeah, right. yeah, Ritter. yeah. Um, in my mind. But we have our backup going in, too, though, so I don't, I don't, I don't mm-hmm. get it. But yours, yours has experience. He has, well, he has almost true. a whole season under his belt <laughs> between true. two years. Um, in my mind, I know I've said that a lot tonight. In, uh, I know I've not picked against you yet, and I'm, you should be 12-0, and 0, but it's fine. No, we should. We should you know, yeah. Anyway. 
Yeah, if, I'm gonna say the Ravens do uh, make it happen, but they don't cover. I, I say you win by like two field goals. I say you win by six, maybe not the full touchdown. I would, I'll take that Atlanta plus seven. Yeah, I'll do the same Atlanta's thing. Atlanta's defense is come. I'm not saying great, but they're gonna, they can, ma- they'll make some stops. I'll do, I'll do the same thing. I'll take Atlanta plus seven and a half. Let's bet it. That's one we should bet. I'll take, yeah, oh yeah, I'll take Atlanta plus seven and a half. But but we're, we're gonna win by six. We'll just hey, yeah. we'll just Facetime when I get to when I'm in Washington. I'll just Facetime you where I'm at. Yeah. And you just put on like we just watch your game in your house. Yeah. And I'll watch it where I'm at. Hell yeah, baby. <laughs> uh, next game: Bills at Chicago. Bills nine and a half. Damn, that's a lot. I don't think. Why they do they co- have? I don't think dude, they cover. The last couple of weeks, the Bills have had a lot of far separation when it comes to point spreads. Right. Am I am I making that up? No, you no, you're right. You're right. Because they were supposed to beat Miami by seven, right? Yeah, seven and a half. Yeah. Yeah. So. I think Bills win, but they don't cover. That's a lot, dude. And Chicago at this time of year, that weather and that wind. Well, they both play in that weather, honestly. Well, that's true. Though it is windier at Soldier Field, I it believe. Is windier, I yeah. would say that. Soldier Field ain't shit. I just don't think they're gonna win by nine and ten points on the road. I know you, on you've the never road. been there, have you? No. It looks cool on the outside. You get inside, you're like, Where what is this? This is a jail. Really? <laughs> it's 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 not what you thought it's not what it looks like it could be when you're on the outside. Oh, okay. So like you know, if you, you've been to Chicago, right? You've been no. like Michigan Avenue and all that I've just been in the, I just been to the airport. And about, you know, all the, um, I can't remember what the park's name is. There's a lot of architectural stuff. There's, you know, you can go see the lake and stuff. It's basically the size of an ocean. But well, anyway, real quick, it looks like it could be a lot better from the outside. And you go inside and you go, <laughs> this is what we got. Yeah. Is this it? Serious? I don't know. Hmm. Good. So we taking taking Buffalo in the points. We're taking Chicago. No, I'm gonna say Buffalo, and, and they covered nine just, and a half. I, all, how I would bet that game is Buffalo straight up. I'm not gonna take any points or nothing. Okay. I wouldn't even. My money would be like, let's just pick Buffalo in a parlay. Okay. Saints at Cleveland. Cleveland two and a half. Saints at Cleveland. Saints have tough defense, but I don't know what's a road record. I don't. I know, know you don't that. know, but I'm I'm gonna say the Browns at home. Browns at home. They're kind of in a playoff push ish. I mean, they they're not gonna get in, but they're they're gonna make that. We got Deshaun back. We're starting to make yeah, some strides. Yeah. Let's see what happens. Playing better and stuff like that. Saints don't. I mean, they're kind of in that too a little bit, but. Mm. I mean, they're still in. The, they're only one game out of the. Of well, the, so is Atlanta and Carolina. Right, and all that. right. <laughs> Everybody's that division, right? Yeah. I'm going to go. I'm going to go Browns. I know you don't like that. I know. Hey. I'm yeah, obje- I'm shout a, out the Brownies, I'm a, dude. I'm Come objective. on. The shitty ass Brownies. Well, that's because you're a division rival. Yeah. But I got to shout out my boy Al, dude. Fancy ass well, Al. Yeah, you do. I don't have to. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out Thirst Bet Nation. Yeah, or, but, well, former, former, uh, or no, rest in peace. Rest I, in I peace. don't think they're going to do it anymore. No, it is over. Hey, they don't know we do this. No. Anyway, okay. <laughs> we don't tell anybody we do this. I the internet you. knows. Yeah, the internet knows. <laughs> hey, Ta- if you haven't found it yet, that ain't my problem. It ain't my fault. Yeah, marketing. Well, we know. We, we're, we're, anyway, go ahead. Houston at Tennessee. Tennessee by five. I'm assuming that's. A, I'm assuming that five is assuming that Tannehill's playing, because if if it's Willis playing, I don't think it's five. I think it's because Houston. I Houston, think it's three because the last two games Houston played against Cowboys and K- Kansas City, they've they're showed coming, up. They're they're coming around, right? So I don't think that spread is with um, Willis playing. I think that's no thinking that Tannehill's well, playing. You, I mean, you mentioned that Tannehill might not play, so so that, that's just me. I think. Have it, you heard anything yet? No, I, haven't I, haven't, anything. I haven't seen anything. But I, I, if he's not playing, we'll know by Thursday, I guess. But Friday. Well, but you know, Thursday kind of leaks that yeah. stuff. Like he didn't practice today. Oh yeah, right, right. He limited. Like tomorrow would be like a veteran day off for a lot of guys late in the season. You'll get that. Like he might get one of those. Right. But they'll list it as did not practice. So then, like you're going, oh, what is that? So here's what I'm going to say: If Willis is playing. I'm gonna take Houston. Ooh, yeah, hot take, hot take, baby. Because I want Jackson to go. To, wouldn't do it. I want. I do too. I, <laughs> I really do, I do want too. I want to see it happen. <laughs> I know because nobody picked him to win it. I mean, just no. go back five weeks. Nope. You were like, oh, the same old Jags. Same old Jags. You could say that about uh, the Lions too. Uh, I'm getting there. We'll get there. <laughs> okay. Um, Seattle at Kansas City. Kansas City covers. Kansas City nine and a half. Next. Next. Nine and a half. <laughs> Yeah, dude, it's not. It's not gonna be pretty. Nine and a half. You think they're gonna win by ten? Oh yeah, easily. Easily. You see how they played the last couple of weeks, though. It they matter. struggled against Denver. They struggled against Houston. This is a serious juggernaut, and I don't. Think and they don't run the ball though. See, Kansas City does not. Ooh, run. I'll take that back. Yes, Scanling's Kansas City. out, right? Who? Marcus Valdez, Scanling the third or sixteenth. Oh, 16th? I have no idea. I just know that they don't run the ball. 
So and that's your weakness, and they don't do that. Yeah, but so don't worry about it. Still have Pat Mahomes and Kelsey. Yes, 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 but they don't run the ball. Well, you know, whatever. You still taking Kansas City the points? Yep. I mean, me too. Okay. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, hey, I'm, I'm going to make that game fun. And we're going to, you know, we'll be in Washington watching that with some homies. But, yeah. dude, we're going to, I'm going to, I'll just do what I did for the San Francisco game. It's going to be on Fox, even though it's Kansas City. <clears throat> it's 10 a.m. in Washington, too. Oh, you're out behind? Yeah. Oh, I know that. I'll be, uh, I'll be at the pub early. Giants at Minnesota, 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 three and a half. Giants at Minnesota. I'm gonna say Minnesota wins only because I need Giants to lose. To lose, but I I still think Minnesota come. They're high now off of that comeback. They have to be right. You're just gonna be like that's that's a huge confidence boost for your right? team. Right. I, I think the Giants should not have won on Sunday. I so don't think it's be a PI so goal. so <laughs> I think that is a is a is a flaw. Yeah, yeah. That's just gonna be okay. Bengals at New England. Bengals three and a half. Right. I'm saying New England on this one. I really am. Yeah. Because I don't think they're gonna get Belichick's gonna wring their necks all week, and then they're gonna just gonna go, hey. But Belichick you're is all a, fired if you do Belichick lose. is a mastermind on the defensive side of the football. Sure, and he's gonna look at what Tampa Bay did in that first half, mm-hmm. and he just I think he's gonna take your best best thing you do yeah. away, which is throwing the football. He always does that. Right? He's great at that. Which is throwing, which is throwing the football. Mm-hmm. So I think he's gonna take away Chase and that crossing pattern slant stuff away. And I just feel I just feel like after that loss against the Raiders, yeah. I don't, what are we doing? <laughs> I just feel I don't know. Kobe Myers, what are we doing? I, but I would not be shocked if the Bengals did win. No, no. But no, I no. just had this I just had this little urge feeling that the Patriots are going to put it together. It's going to be in Foxville. So that's mm-hmm. a little different than being in Cincinnati. I got gotcha. you. That's just that's just me. I got gotcha. you. But if I put money down, I'm putting money on Cincinnati. But. For for this aspect of it, I'm just saying. I'm saying. Oh, so New you England. take New England. And what's the point spread again? Three and a half. Three and a half. Ooh, I'd tease it to like six. New England. Well, That's what I would do. I'd tease yeah. it to six. Okay. I think it'll be a closer game than people think. And so do I. Yeah. Lions at Panthers. Lions two and a half. Lions getting after. I dude. think so too. I know the Panthers are playing good. Don't get me wrong. Well, they lost last weekend. They lost right? to Pittsburgh at yeah. home. Yeah. So the Pittsburgh got good defense, and neither one really has an offense. Um. That's that's one of those games where it's like, what? Whose defense is going to prevail? Right. I'm going Lions. They keep the streak alive. Can okay. make a playoff push. Okay. Dude, they'll be eight I agree. seven just like that. Yes, man. I'm going to put the playoff tracker in. I'm going to see what that looks like. But you know what's funny? What's that? Seattle has tiebreak over them. Boom. Yeah. They do. Boom. Um, what's the Seahawks record though? No, seven, seven seven. seven. So you seven, lose seven. though, you go you're behind them. They're, yeah. No, I get that. Yeah. But don't worry, we'll catch up. We'll catch up. <laughs> Commanders at 49ers. 49ers by seven. I'm surprised it's so low. I thought that would be a 10-point ten, ten spread. Mm. I'm going to San Francisco. Yeah. But, hey, make no mistake. Washington has to travel. Commanders is uh, – what did I just say? Commanders? Yeah. I thought I said Mariners. For some reason, I felt like I just said Mariners. Anyway. They have to travel, though. Commanders got to travel. doesn't matter. And that defense of San Francisco is legit. Well, is, they Chase, going, is they Chase Young coming back? He had to practice. He's in practice this week. Well, it's Tuesday. Well, he's still in practice. Mm, are you sure? Yeah, it's, uh, it's all the report. They said he might play this weekend. That's what uh, Around the NFL posted on Twitter a couple hours ago. I'm pretty sure. That's what it, it doesn't matter. Anyway, I like San Francisco to win the game, uh-huh. but Washington's going to make it tough. They got a defense. They, they, they are going to make it tough. They're scrappy. They are going to make it tough, but San Francisco, I think, is going to end does up. The, does the Purdy magic run out, though? No, not not not, not this week. Wait, when, well, we'll talk about that. I'll later. tell you when. <laughs> NFC Championship game. <laughs> Playoffs. Shaking your head. It's too, mic- too um, much. Warm. John Harbaugh told Rich Eisen that the Ravens are still in on Odell Beckham. Whoa, weird. Wait, why would he say that? Because we don't have the receivers. Well, watch Lamar goes. Oh yeah, hey coach, I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so Lamar, what are you doing here? Are we both? Are we both going Forty Nineers? Yeah, let's go Niners. I'm just saying it's gonna be a it's gonna be a dog fight. That's so that's gonna go. Are they gonna win by seven? No, nah, it'll be a field goal by Robbie Gold. So you're saying Washington the points then? Yeah. Washington okay. Points. I'm, that's not, that's I'm a, taking four nope. Niners. Niners money line. Niners gonna whoop them. Oh shit. Thirty five ten. That's a bill. That's a bold call. Get some hot takes on these this week. Motherfuckers. <laughs> put, your, put your money where the mouth is. I want to. I'm I'm recording this. I'm gonna write all this I'll down. Put my five dollars on there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Eagles at Cowboys. Eagles four, Cowboys four and a half. 
That's because it hurts not playing. That's all because it hurts. And I'm still taking Philly. Gardner Minshew. I'm taking Philly. Gardner Minshew. I'm taking Philly. Wazoo in the house, baby. I'm taking Philly. I, I am too. I'm Their defense Philly. is nasty, dude. I'm telling you. It's, it's better underrated. Than think. It's better than people Way think. underrated. Nobody's giving them credit. I mean, some people are. Not everyone's giving them credit. I know everyone's looking at San Fran like they're, you know, they are. They're the top right. defense. They have all the rankings, all that stuff. I'm telling you, Philly gets after it, yeah. dude. They got some dogs. So yep. it's, it's, uh, yeah. And you know what? Dallas just, what, what are we doing, Dallas? I don't same know. old Cowboys. Same old Cowboys. Shout out Richard Sherman. Right before I got here, he goes, hey, same old Cowboys. Well, yeah. And everyone's <laughs> calling for Dak's head. Like, oh, we got to get rid of him. Like, hey, look, guess what, guys? He's going to be there for a while. Keep yeah. buying his jersey. Yeah. And shove it. I don't think I don't even think Sunday was was on Dak. I think Sunday no, was on. No, it's not on him. It was on the defense, and it, it, that's it. I know. Shout yeah. out Michael Parsons. He's awesome. He is awesome, but he didn't back up what he says he's gonna do. So that's true. He, he bet. Well, in this week it won't and matter. Now, now he's got. Well, now he's got a target on his back. Yeah, he does. I know that Hurts isn't in there. He might not play. But he which still, he's he probably still, not play. He still has to come out with two sacks. He got to do something because he was talking a lot. Yep. He buried himself out there with yep. that shit talking. He was doing about Hertz on the pod on uh, was it Von Miller's podcast? Yeah, Von Miller is shout out Von Miller. The Von Cost. The Von Cost. It's like all right, dude. Raiders at Steelers. Steelers by three. Uh, dude, I'm going Raiders. Oh, riding the high. I'm riding the high. Uh, yeah, they got Waller back, and they got mm-hmm. uh, what's his name, uh, Darren Waller, and who else? And Renfro. Yeah, Renfro. Yeah. I'm going Raiders. I'll run it with the Ravens. Raiders. And, and Raiders. Supposed to, pick is supposed to start, so I just, I just don't. We need more of these anyway. Oh yeah, we do. <laughs> You've been um, out for a minute, huh? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm, I'm, I'm going, I'm going Raiders. You know, Steelers are favored by three, and oh. that, and this win by the Raiders will give Tom and his, um, will stop snap his winning streak of being over 500, because they will have nine losses. Oh shit! And he can't, can't get 500. But they know what they were going into when they lost Ben. Yeah, I know. I know. I mean, we can do. Uh, Packers at Dolphins. Dolphins only four and a half. Oh, really? Yeah. I know the Packers just beat the Rams. But that's just another Who cares? four win team. Yeah. There's some bad calls in that game, too, man. Oh, I'm telling you. I'm just surprised it was it's four and a half. Yeah. Who do you like? What are you taking? I'm, I'm taking Miami. I'll take Miami straight up. I'm not yeah. going to play any points or nothing like that. Uh, they're going to cover. Gonna That'd be a, like a five team parlay. I'll put them on there. Miami's going to cover. Okay. Yeah. Because they're on a three game skid, right? Yeah, we lost three in a row. So they're eight and seven? No. They're eight and six. But they lost three in a row. Oof. They lost some good teams. We lost three, three straight road games. They lost to some good teams. They lost to Chargers, yep. San Francisco, and Buffalo. Three good teams? Yeah. Three playoff teams. Yeah. What else we got? Is that it? Nope. No. Nope. <laughs> Broncos at Rams. That's a tough one to call. I'm going to say Broncos. Both 4 and 10. I don't think Russ is playing, right? On this one, he might. He didn't play last week, but he might play. Ah. Shut him down, dude. Hey. Yeah, sit down. Well, you know what, though? Nah, oh, Broncos, oh, oh. Broncos defense Breaking is Breaking news. ESPN just reported what I said earlier. Oh, no. YouTube TV emerges oh. as front runner. That's still, that's awesome. Shout out YouTube. <laughs> right? Dude. You know how many... <laughs> This algorithm's up. Let me tell you. I know. <laughs> so you taking Broncos still? Yeah, I'm going to go Broncos. Yeah. I don't want them to win because I want the second or third pick. And I think we'll still stay at the third pick yeah. at the end of the day, but I'd rather have the Rams lose. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going Broncos. The defense, I think, is better than, than – I mean, I think, I think they're Broncos, doing the uh, I think Broncos experience. defense is better than what the Rams offense is going to produce, so I think they're going to be able to shut them down more. Mm-hmm. And I think the Broncos offense could score at least 10 points to win the game. Well, yeah, that's true. They scored, 20, they, score? they scored 24 last week. That's the most in seven games they scored? Yeah, Something all, like that? Maybe all season. No, mm, I thought there was a game they won. They scored uh, – no, against the Chiefs, they scored 28. Yeah, did they? Yeah. Because oh, okay. remember, they were coming back. It was 34-28, I think, was the final score. Oh, okay. And Chiefs were up 34-7 or something like that. Okay, okay, okay. You're right, you're right. I know. I'll tell you later. <laughs> okay, uh, Sunday night is Tampa at Cardinals. Tampa. Why aren't they flexing that out? <sighs> they flexed it in. <laughs> <laughs> what? It's Christmas Day game, Sunday night. Oh, that's why, like, hey. Yeah. I know you guys. Yeah, it's Tom. Tom. Hey, it's Tom. 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 Last hey Tom, we know you ain't going home for Christmas. <laughs> you, ain't sure. go, you, ain't home. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't going home. You ain't going home. So put your ass on TV in Arizona. Um, Tampa Bay, six and a half. He, he's going to like it here. Six I, and a half? I say they cover. Six, oh, yeah. Hey, Tampa Bay has a t- 
top five Colt McCoy's in concussion protocol, so he might not even yeah, play. They have a they have a tough defense. I know it always doesn't show it, but they just they do have a tough defense. And for some reason, when it counts, though, they're not putting it together, and I don't understand what they're doing. Right. Last week, and I I'm like, what 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 is happening? I don't know. And the last one is Chargers at the Colts. Chargers by four. Yeah, Chargers, Chargers cover that. Chargers cover for that. sure. Colts ain't coming back from this one. No, their their season's done. Dude, Steve Smith's in it. First this interim. Done. First, yeah. I was going to say, Steve Smith, shout out Steve Smith, said uh, Jeff Shatterday is the first interim coach to get fired. I was like, oh, whoa, whoa. MJD goes, hey, you're being crazy right now, dog. What are you doing? <laughs> That's kind of tough to call. Jordan Poole. Hey, stop. stop. Don't de- de- uh, demoralize what the Knicks are doing right now. Don't. S- excuse me. Excuse me. Hey, look, look, I'm going to tell you right now. This is what we're doing. Golden State's very good, okay? They don't have Steph Curry. Oh, that was a hard dunk. Anyway, the best dunker. He's the best. There's some other dunkers, but he's the best dunker. Okay, anyway, what I'm telling you right now, the New York Knicks are a good team. They're a very good team. But I'm telling you right now, oh, that's enough of my impression. I can't keep going. <laughs> yeah, you can. You do it awesome. Keep doing it. I was like, what? <laughs> Okay, so you want to know what the standards are right now, or you you want me to put in the games first and then tell you? Well, I thought you were going to put all the games in. No, I was going to do it right now. Oh, oh, weird! I thought you did that. No, I don't have the spread spread on on the on the. Mm, the I got you. Go ahead, put all your winners in there. Huh? Go ahead, put all your winners. Recap. Okay, recap. Recap so the recap. We got Jacksonville over Jets. Yes, sir. We got Baltimore over Atlanta, but they don't cover. Right. Lions over Carolina. Buffalo over Chicago. Yep. Browns over Saints. Yep. Chiefs over Seattle. Mm -hmm. Minnesota over Giants. Yes, sir. Now, I I said New England, but you said Cincinnati. And I said, if I put money down, I'll say Cincinnati. So I'm going to go Cincinnati. Well, let's do it. Right? Okay. Put it in there. And then I'm going to change that one because I think that's going to be a difference maker. Okay. Hey, well, hey, go with what you said. It's going to be. I'll let you do it. Run the show. I'll come back. And then Tennessee over Houston. Who's staying with that? If as Hill much as you don't want it to happen. If Tannehill doesn't play, I don't. Okay. San Francisco or Washington? Dude, it's hard when you make picks on Tuesday. I know. <laughs> I'll seek an injury report. We're going, we're going Philly over Dallas still? Yeah. I'm. Uh, yeah. Raiders or Pittsburgh? I think we said Raiders. We both said Raiders. I said Raiders. I don't, no, we, okay. we okay. both did, remember? And Miami over Green Bay. Yep. Denver over Rams. Yep. Bucks over Cardinals. Yep. And Chargers over Colts. Yes, sir. Okay, so right now we have Philly still the one seed. Yep. Minnesota two seed. Yep. San Fran three. Um, Tampa Bay four. Dallas five. Mm-hmm. Giants six. Detroit seventh. Look at that. Washington out. Yeah, especially yeah. And then we have in the AFC side we have Buffalo one. Yep. Kansas City two. Cincinnati three. Tennessee stays because they won four. Yeah. But if they lost, it would have been Jacksonville. Uh, Baltimore, five. Mm-hmm. Chargers, Still six. Still in the playoffs, dude. Still in the playoffs. Chargers, six. Miami, seven. Ooh. That Miami-Kansas City matchup might be legit with Tyreek going back to Kansas City. Ooh. They're going to boo the shit out of him. <sighs> now he's going to score touchdowns, though. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> so, and if I put the, what, the New England game... Then Baltimore is third seed and um, Cincinnati is fifth seed. That's the only change that happens. Yeah. N- nothing really happens there. But if I put, if Tennessee loses, then, then that's Jacksonville's spot. Oof. I like I like that I see Lions and Jacksonville and just like that. Dude, I, if you would have told me five years ago, like, oh, they'll make the playoffs, I'd have been like, you're fucking high. Right. <laughs> Seriously. Well, it's like I, It's like I always say. How long are we going to pretend these guys that keep picking in the top five, these teams like the Lions and the Jaguars on them? Yeah, I know that, okay, I, they somewhat know what they're doing. And that's, let's be honest, sometimes the draft is a crapshoot. You know what I mean? Right. Not, not everybody's great, but there's guys that are in the fifth and sixth and seventh round that end up being stars in the NFL, you know? Yeah, no, even, like, like Tom Brady. Yeah. Or like a Brock Purdy right now. He's on his way. I mean, well, just, he's got three games on his belt. But, you know, like, say he does this for a couple more years. You'd be like, shit, that's crazy. You know? Yeah, he'd be, the, he'd be the greatest player of all time. Stop it. Well, that's what everybody says. Well, there's one person who says that. I don't. I don't say it. Everybody says that Tom Brady's the greatest player of all time. Oh, no. I was talking six about Brock Purdy. I know. Sixth-round draft pick. Oh, well, yeah. 
Richard Sherman's a was Richard Sherman fifth round? Fifth round. He ain't a Hall of Famer. He will be. No. What? No. How would he not be? I don't think he has the stats. I don't I just don't think he has the stats. Been to three Super Bowls. Won one. Been to three? Wasn't he a defensive player defensive rookie of the year too? Who did he go to the Super Bowl with besides Seattle? Twice with Seattle, once with San Fran. He was on the San Fran team? Yeah. When they lost to Kansas, Kansas City? City. I I didn't know that. Remember he couldn't stop. Shout out to Richard Sherman, we love you. But you couldn't stop what's his name on the goal line in the pylon. Oh, yeah, the yeah, pi- yeah. Remember the pylon cam yeah. with him landing in it? Yeah. After I he, missed the, he missed the guy. He's like, yeah, Oops. I just don't think he has, the, he has the stats to become a Hall of Fame corner. Mm, I think he Although, has a rookie record for passes defended. Okay, when you're a rookie and compared to a, a career. That's a, that's well, a, I mean, I'm saying he's got, he's got records, dude. Okay. But okay, guess what? Seattle's well, going to put him in the ring of honor. Boom. There you go. Perfect. That's all I need. I think the whole whole oh, well, the only person that won't be in there is Earl Thomas. He blew his shot, right? He won't. He wait. He's Chancellor will, right? Yeah. yeah. And, well, how long did Chancellor play though? Five years? Seven. Chancellor will. Bobby Wagner will. Wagner for sure. KJ Wright. Be Wags. KJ Wright will be eventually. It'll be a little bit, but he'll be there. Sherman. Yep. Not the other corner, Maxwell. He won't be in it. No, no, not not there long enough. Not Brennan Browner. Not Maxwell. Russ, Russ will right. Russell end up being a ring of honor. You can't take 10 years away from it. He has majority of the quarterback records for Seattle. Right. He doesn't have all of them? Mm, I'm sure there's a couple. That, dude, how many records are there? There's uh, yeah, so many. As, as of now, D- DK's on his way there, right? Yeah, he'll, yeah him and uh, Tyler Lockett, I would say. Lockett. Um, it's just you, you, you're going to have to put the LOB in there. That, you can't put them all in there, dude. No, no, no. Wagner, Sherman, Chancellor, Wright, Averill. You're going to put those guys in there. Averill? No. Cliff Averill? No. Cliff Averill went from the 0-16 no. Lions. No. And then won the Super Bowl the next year. I know, but that doesn't make you a ring of honor. No, I'm just giving you a stat. I put, I put, He'll be in there. I, I put, bet you they I put, put him Bennett in. in there before I put Averill. Bennett only played for three years. Averill was there for five. Well, how many years of those was like, oh, you did something? Cliff Averill was vital. No. Well, you would know more than I do, but I'm not putting yeah, him in so, there. Yeah, so he's... Zip it over there. Zip it, Take Miller. A, Zip it, Miller. <laughs> <laughs> Take a suckle of my zipper. Z- <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just don't think he is though. When you come along, you must. So, you, are you are you backtracking uh, Sherman being in the Hall of Fame? No, you I think he'll still be in the Hall of Fame. Mm. We don't we don't have the stats in front of us to judge. Are you gonna bring it up? I Hell look. yeah, bring this I'm, shit up. I'm gonna look. Yo, Miller, bring that up. What do, what do you want? I really to- do want some when we. Put our video up finally. I do want someone to be able to come up like, hey, pull up what we're talking about. You know what I mean? Yeah. You get more conversation out of things like that. You know what I mean? Right. You do. What do you think of Jonathan Kaminga? Um, he could jump. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. The 6'10 guy can jump. Of course. He's not 6'10. Kaminga's not 6'10? No. They all, honestly, they all look 6'10 other than you know, Brunson. He looks like he's 5'4". I know he's six three, but I just no. Said. He's six two. Oh, so sorry. Six one. I think six one. <clears throat> How's that a foul? He stuck his head in his guts. What are we? What? What are you supposed to do? About he's that? a five time Pro Bowl. Boom. Three time All Pro. Okay. Hey, hey, stop right there. No. S- listen to me. Stop right there. Three time All Pro. Does that get you Hall of Fame? All Pro first team, right? Yeah, say it. Yeah, All, all Pro is first team. So, okay, okay. You're a big All Pro guy. Also a big Pro Bowl guy. But go ahead. Tell me. Uh, what else you want to know, though? I don't know what else stats no, you want. No, no. I want you to tell me, based on those two stats, is that Hall of Fame worthy? No. Because we saw people that are Hall of Fame who have even records winning. Correct. We have less, uh, you know, very. Well, well Eli Manning's one not Hall of Fame almost, yet. Almost one to, he's going to be. One to one ratio on he touchdowns was not, to interceptions. He was the rookie of the year, by the way. He finished fifth. I know I made that up. Well, I mean, yeah. <laughs> if you want defense, play, defense rookie of the year, I'll probably give it to you. But no, mm-hmm. I can't now. Okay, so anyway, what what else has he got? Um, Send me the accolades. Oh, accolades! That's that's it. What? Yeah, that's it. No nope. Su- Super Bowl winner, Pro Bowl, first team All Pro, three time, three time, and five time Pro Bowler, or yeah. six time, five, 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 five times. Went to three Super Bowls. One, one. He's got to have some other records, though, right? He's got to have NFL records. It's got to be some. Like, hey, awards and honors. He's the only player in the NFL history to run back a pick six with one shoe on. 
<laughs> oh man. <Hey. laughs> That's funny. Hey. Yes, sir. This is a thousand percent true. That's he came funny. back in overtime to beat the, the Texans and he had one shoe on when he was when he caught the ball. <laughs> that is funny. Shout out Richard Sherman. We love you, dude. That's funny. Yeah, I just I don't know. I mean, it would have to be when he, when he's up for the award, like who's out there. You're saying in comparison to who's on the ballot at the time. Yeah. Oh, that's cheap. I just I just don't I, me personally don't think his resume is a Hall of Fame. So then you have to look at who's wh- so what how do they decide? It's not the year you were cho- you know in the league. It's it's just whoever they thought that year would be a finalist, right? Or something like that. It was whenever you're eligible. You have to be, be gone five five years from from the Now maybe the I'm not saying he's first ballot Hall of Fame, but he's a Hall of Famer. See, and that's another thing. If you can't make the Hall of Fame in your first two ballots, you shouldn't be in the Hall of Fame. Well, you have high expectations, so I get that. Hall of Fame should be high expectations. No, I get no. I'm not. Well, dude, this they don't just put anybody in there. Yeah, they do. Who? Yeah, you can't say that without somebody without backing it up. Troy Aikman. He deserves a Hall of Fame. Three times Super Bowl champ. Stop it. That's the only reason why. And wasn't he Super Bowl MVP twice? No. What? No. Was One. he league MVP? No. 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 Come on. No. Seriously. Yeah. Oh, we went over the stats. Yeah. 94 and 71 record. Yeah. Uh, one to one touchdown interception yeah, rate. Yeah, but you can't always put just wins under a quarterback's belt. You tell me what you tell, give you stats. I'm giving you stats. I know. <laughs> I, my argument is you can't just go off of that, though. And he had like 39,000 <clears throat> yards passing. Different time, though. Joe Montana has more. Yeah, but still different times. No, not different offenses, dude. Bill Walsh was always. Oh, so now it's the Bill offenses. Walsh, Bill you, Walsh you was. Said, you said different time. It's, not, it's the same time. But at that time, in those times, it's, it's like anything. It's who does what was with, it, wasn't what their team is. Okay. Bill Walsh is different than, you know, Jimmy Johnson and, and uh, well, what was the other guy? Jimmy um, from Oklahoma. What's his name? Uh, a Barry Switzer. A Barry Switzer, sorry. Yeah. Barry Switzer inherited that team. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. So. I just. I just just don't see it, but okay. Hey, I need some energy out of you. What's going on? Nothing. Sleepy? I'm good. I'm good. Oh, okay. No, I'm just saying. I just, I just don't see him being a Hall of Fame. <laughs> and you do. Well, I can see everything in that shirt right now. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> you in this damn shirt. See, I knew I shouldn't have kept this on. <laughs> it almost made me feel bad. I was like, oh, was I supposed to wear a shirt today like this? Or? <laughs> no, that's tomorrow. This shit's, dude, <laughs> that's a wild shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it's only come out every once a year. <laughs> I'm gonna borrow from you. <laughs> It'd be like a blanket on you. <laughs> no, we're the same height. We're the same size, right? No, this no. I'm just kidding, no, dude. You're I'm not. just kidding. <laughs> not the same size. Not the same size. Well, what? You wanna wrap it up? Yeah, baby. It was pretty good. It was very good. Hey, I always enjoy talking to you. We're on Spotify. We're on YouTube. We're on YouTube, Spotify, we're on Instagram, we're on Instagram, TikTok, TikTok. We're on YouTube Shorts. YouTube Shorts. I'm enjoying the hell out of this. Oh, thing. yeah. This is so much fun. Ladies and gentlemen, be ready for our Christmas edition podcast tomorrow, Ooh. baby. Yeah. I'm going to I'm gonna post this one this week, and then we'll post Christmas. After Christmas. Uh, I think I might do a Saturday night roll. Well, okay, I'll you? be in Washington, but yeah, we're going to get it in tomorrow. Yeah. I got a whole bunch of stuff for you, sir. Oh, my goodness. We'll talk about Christmas tomorrow, though. Yeah. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us. It's Nathan. Yep. It's Miller. Two bears, two mics. This is what we do, and we out. You.